Do, do you see the Netflix original content model not scaling? It seems like they're injecting so much capital into original content and without growing subscribers, it makes it hard for them to justify that that as a cost. I think there's there's definitely a link between the two. And it's kind of funny. A big a big knock on Netflix has been the accounting discrepancy between cash flows and and the gap income statements, given how the content spends amortized. And I, su- I used to joke a little bit before we came to this period that if you're a Netflix pool, the thing you don't want to happen is for those two numbers to come together mm. because you want the you want the content spend to keep growing because that that suggests that the subscriber base and the revenue base is continuing yes. to grow. It's pretty clear that we're going to see the opposite of that now. Those two numbers are are going to start to converge. Yeah. At least I just think it's a big it's a big problem for them to address is is when they put you know call it two hundred million dollars behind a movie. It's a lot different than making the next version of the Avengers where you know you have a fan base, you have a really good sense that if you produce a halfway decent movie, you're going to get hundreds of millions of dollars or a billion plus in, in box office revenues. And then it has the ability to really drive your streaming service on the back end. Netflix is, you know, with evergreen IP or evergreen content, you you don't have that same assurance. So that really requires you to up your game and, and to find a lot of things like Squid Game and the like. And, you know, we're, we're finding out that that's pretty hard to do. I do think there's also, there's potentially some of the issue here with what's the term for, you know, when you go to a grocery store and there's 20 different brands of, of grape jelly, it's harder to make a choice because there's so many options as opposed to walking into a Costco and you got Kirkland and you have Welch's and that's yep. it. And it, may, it just makes it much easier. I think they have, they probably have an ability to cut back their spend in a way that actually adds to the user experience potentially. So.